Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming with another episode of Stardew Valley. All right, when we left off, uh, <laughs> we had had been just trying to keep the farm organized a little better and also dealing with missions in the town and whatnot. Also, I had to restart this episode's recording because I had the biggest lag spike I ever saw. And then I swore, literally a minute into the episode. <laughs> and I couldn't use that take. So I decided, screw it, I will restart. Because <laughs> I went a minute into the episode and just couldn't stop swearing. It was like right here. I had the biggest lag spike I've ever had. And I'm going to tack it on on the end of the episode so you all understand that it was so odd. But I... I just started swearing. And that's because I don't have enough caffeine in my system when I start recording. See, look what I'm talking about. Weird lag spikes out of nowhere. Driving me up a wall. Anyway. <laughs> when we left off, we were busy trying to get the farm more or less settled up to as far as we can possibly manage. That is mahogany seed. That's fine. All right, getting it all set up so that way we can't really have issues with the watering of plants. There we go. That's the words that were trying to come out of my mouth. Clearly, I still actually need more caffeine, <laughs> but it's fine. It's fine. All right, I'm going to put this here. Actually, you know what? I'm not going to put that particularly here. Because the Omni Geodes I need for currency over in the desert. So I'm going to hold on to them. Anytime I find them, I'm going to hold on to them. And if I head out to the desert, I take them with me. For no other reason than to try and clear up my inventory space just a little bit more. A little bit more than Sweet F.A. <laughs> because that seems to be what I'm doing so far. All right, so all those gold bars, put them in. Now I'm sitting at 51. Not, you know, the most even number, but it's a high number, so there's at least that. Um, that's not what I wanted to do. What I wanted to do... Ah, screw it. Pick it up. That's what I to do. A and B, put it over here. Put that over there. Like I said, I'm trying to clear out my inventory... Because I realize I have a little too much stuff going on in here. A little too much. And I need to deal with it somehow. So. Just drink the coffee. Do like what I should be doing in real life. And just downing coffee as much as I can to get stuff done. And one of those things I need to get done. Which is why I have the hardwood in my backpack. Is for collecting hardwood for Robin. So I have a second chance at doing this particular one. Uh, Abigail also needed quartz to pull a prank on her dad. That one's actually probably the most time dependent. And the one that's harder to complete because of that. So I'll just grab one and get that taken care of. I swear to everything wholly concerned. Hey, please deal with these lag spikes because it's driving me up a wall. Including the one that made me swear uncontrollably for the first <laughs> first minute of my attempted recording of the episode. It would be so nice. Oh, it's closed on Wednesdays. Fantastic. That means I have no idea where Abigail is. Fan freaking testic. And she's definitely not in there. Uh, I have no idea where she would be. I have no idea. I have literally no idea. Now well, Pam's heading out to the bus stop. That's good. Which reminds me, I didn't check the weather, but it's fine. It's fine. Well, you know what? It's fine. It's fine. It's all fine. Other than these lag spikes. But otherwise, perfectly fine. I have no idea where she would be. None. No idea. I 
am half tempted just to grab my phone from the other side of the room and find out where she would be. Because I have no idea. None. Zippity doo diddly. Of course it's closed. Of course it'd be closed. There's Kent. I doubt she's over here. I honestly doubt it, but... Yes, I want the coffee. I want the coffee. I want to be able to move. Alright. Sure, she's not over here either. But I just don't have a choice. I need to find where she went. And I can't go to her dad's shop. Because it's closed on Wednesdays. <clears throat> Okay, there we go. Just running around like a crazy person. Because I can't find... Oh, there she is. Abby! Give me a second. Abby, Abby. Hello, you brought me the item I asked for. I really appreciate it. Let's see, here's what I owe you. <laughs> Perfect. Here's your reward, Thomas. Don't say a word to my dad. Fair enough. If you're ever bored, you can always hang out in my room. What? As long as I'm not changing, of course. Well, I mean, I, I figured that was probably a stipulation, but still. Oh, I'm now allowed to hang out in her room. Holy crap. I'm in there, boys. I'm in there. Uh, yeah. Okay, she's up to three. Oh. Oh, great. That's fantastic. I have more relationship with almost everyone that isn't a marriage candidate. But still... Yay! I'm in there. In there, boys. Alright. 75. Perfect. Alright. Which reminds me, I need to check out what day her birthday is. I need to maximize my plan. <laughs> okay. Sound like a freaking evil villain now. Uh, it isn't this month. Okay, we're good. Oh. It's the wizard's birthday. How high up is my relationship with him again? Oh, it's pretty high up already. And you know what? You know what? It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I need more coffee. Coffee, 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 coffee. Yes. <laughs> All right, time to get more hardwood. Like I had initially planned. All right. My cat's down here. <coughs> of course. All right. head into the forest where the hardwood would be and get that taken care of wow <laughs> that was shockingly fast there we go dwarf scroll three i'm fairly certain i have that already tucked away somewhere did I really get stuck back here? Alright. Almost did. Basically almost did. Okay, cool. I was trying to deal with all the slimes before they tried to come and attack me, but apparently I was a little too slow. Dwarf Scroll 2. I'm just getting a whole bunch of those. chance to get more hardwood growing at my farm, the better. Mainly so I can collect it later. Because any and every chance is probably a good opportunity. Alright. 
And that's done, and we're now at what? 45. We're more than halfway there. Beautiful. All right. Then we are golden for finishing out this one. Okay. I'm gonna throw the crocus I picked up. Crocus? I still don't know how to pronounce that thing. So, fuck it. Hey, I'm not allowed to swear this late in the episode. <laughs> so, wahoo. Pretty sure... Whoop. That was weird. Pretty sure I sweared enough. <laughs> to me. Uh, it was late enough in the episode for me to swear. So, I've sweared enough to redeem myself. Okay. I... Hmm. No idea where... There we go. There's the, where the sap goes. And we'll bring it up to 200. Yeah, that's a good idea. And the mahogany seed I shall plant. Or shall I plant? Uh, here, maybe? Yeah, good enough. Just plant them around... Just around the place. That's all. That's all good. And I think the winter root we put in the fridge. Yes, we do. Okay, fantastic. And we'll call that good. And then the night market starts in about 40 minutes. So I'll head down that way now. Half hour left, let's go. Run my fucking butt down there. Now that I'm allowed to swear, I'm swearing a little too much. I should probably cool it, but fuck that. Alright. Ha ha! The night market is now open. Weird little lag spike once it opened, but hey. It's fine. It was loading in all the people. Canes? No. I don't need those. Stump torch. And plane torch. And nah. Don't need it. The fishing part I don't need to do anymore. some coffee. Thank you. Mix up for all the ones I spent. Smells great, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah, it do. I need more coffee in my life. Hey! Uh, pfft. She has basic fertilizer. Yeah, that's useful. And one bug meat for a hundred. <laughs> no! Not spending that for that. Ancient seeds. No. Mahogany table? No. Corn! Yeah! Corn! Uh, nah. I kind of like this one. For 1200 Yeah, sure. Three trees. Rather boringly titled, but otherwise okay. Let's see the mermaids again, huh?
Bye. Love you. Okay, that was worth it. Okay. <laughs> that calmed me down. I am now okay. I am now so okay with everything. Have you seen the Mermaid Show? It's my favorite. I wonder why, Alex. It must be so thrilling to travel the world like they do. Yeah, it probably would be, wouldn't it? What up? <laughs> I don't know what I was about to say. I was trying to say Super Saiyan Sam, but I don't know why my mouth was not saying those words. Maybe if all else fails, I'll become a submarine captain. That might be cool. I mean, it's worth a shot. This is one of the newer traditions in Pelican Town, but we've taken to it rather quickly, haven't we, George? This is one of... Oh, but she just says the same thing. I'm just here for the free coffee. <laughs> I mean... Oh, wait. Elliot's down there. I almost forgot Elliot's down here. A fleet of exotic merchants traveling the world in search of riches beyond imagination. Blah, 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 blah. What an adventure. Yeah. Kind of is, isn't it? Now, if only I could speak the English required to say it. That would be fantastic. <sighs> Alrighty. Time to head home. Now that the night market is concluded. At least as concluded as I'm willing to let it be. Man, it's impossible to see anything in the dark during winter, which also is true of reality, so it's not that far off. Okay, go to sleep for the night. Ta-da! Beautiful. All 68 gold from all of that. <sighs> okay. More cafe. Yes. Alright. And now I should check the weather and everything else. Weather report. Clear and sunny. Fortune teller. Very displeased. Okay, so no skull cave. Spelunking for me. Underneath all that snow, spring seeds are chomping at the bit to start their new lives in the sun. Don't be surprised when spring rolls around and your farm needs some tidying up. Yeah, no, I know. I am well aware of that. Ooh. Here's a vegetable from the little garden I keep out back. You probably have more veggies than you know what to do with, but oh well. Oh, a cauliflower. Nice. Hmm. I would like to give you some information about an un upcoming event. The Feast of the Winter Star. It's a time for the community to come together and think back on all the good fortune we've had this year. A favorite tradition is the secret gift exchange, where everyone in town is randomly assigned to someone else. On the day of the festival, everyone brings a gift for their secret friend and surprises them with something special. This year, your secret friend is Evelyn. Evelyn. Okay. Don't tell anyone. The feast will take place on the 25th from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. at the town square. Evelyn. Okay. I just don't know what Evelyn's faves are. Oh, no. I'll have to look that up. I will especially have to look that up soon. It's Evelyn. 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 I have to make sure. Meow. Yeah. To make sure to remember that, if for no other reason than to not screw it up. She's a nice, sweet old lady. I'd hate myself if I screwed that up. Alrighty. Put the mushroom in here, or at least this one. And cauliflower. Well, I. I feel like I don't need that. But I, 
I don't know why I feel that. Because <laughs> I'm pretty sure I don't need it for the community center or anything. I don't need to give it to someone or anything like that. So I kind of feel bad, but I kind of want to just sell it. <laughs> uh, kind of feel bad saying that, but I just, there's no other reason to keep it. I, I can't put any of it up? What? Oh, there we go. I was hitting the wrong button. That was why. There we go. Much better. Much, 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 much better. All right. Okay, Evelyn is my secret Santa gift person that I give the gift to on the 25th. So I need to make sure to get that right. I mean, diamond is probably a safe assumption, and I can easily get more of those. But it's best to find out if that is truly what it is that you would enjoy the most. All right. A little foraging done. Any missions over here? Nope. Hey, what's up? It's a good time to explore the caves. Yeah, you're right. It is. It absolutely is. Just not the Skull Cave. Because I will die. <laughs> I will die. It's not worth it. At least not right now. And there goes the like spike. Nice. Uh, at least they're small ones. You know, at least they're small ones, not like the one that caused me to cuss like a sailor. <laughs> uh, swear cuss? I don't know what happened there. Swear cuss, my brain decided it didn't want to settle on one word, so I wanted to go with multiple at once. Because that's exciting, I guess. Uh, brain broke it did. That's what happened. Well, that wasn't difficult. More mahogany seeds. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. Cool. 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 Oh, you. little bastard. You little feckin' bastard. Oh! Bitch! You bitch-sickle. Alright. Let us go down here. Get all of these. Perfect. And that brings me up to 57. It should. It should do that. Yeah, there we go. We good. We good. We good. And I think... I think there's a fully grown mahogany tree near my house. Taking this opportunity. <laughs> Got some iron ore out of that. Alright. That ain't too bad. That ain't too bad at all. Usually I only get copper, so I'm, I'm fine with this. Uh, sap goes that. Not there. Sap and slime goes in here. There we go. Much better. Um, hmm. So because this tree is fully grown, don't want to accidentally scare my cat knocking down this tree. What? 
tree was that then? That wasn't a mahogany tree. What was it? That was the apple tree. <laughs> oh, I'm so dumb. I didn't do anything specifically useful this episode. <laughs> Alright. Alright, fuck it. I'm starting today over. Yes, I know that save scummy. I don't care. <laughs> I don't want to lose my apple tree because I was too stupid to remember it was an apple tree. I will be back. Hey, it's like the day just restarted over again. <laughs> I got a potato this time. What? <laughs> potato. Okay. Still Evelyn, though. Still Evelyn for that. I got a different vegetable, but it's still Evelyn. So I need to make sure that I give Evelyn the proper gift. It's Evelyn. Let's give my cat some water. I'll go get some of the other things taken care of. It just as Robin's gift. Or other Robin's thing. It's project. There we go. That's the word. Gift was for Evelyn. Project was for... Oh, boy. How am I allowed to function as a human being? I don't understand. I don't know. I probably am not supposed to be <laughs> functioning like a human being. <sighs> oh my goodness. Okay. It's because there's no leaves on it, man. I didn't I didn't know <laughs> it was the apple tree, okay? <laughs> Leave me alone. Okay. So I'll do it in this order. Since I do want to go to the caves. Alright, well, there's a lot more slimes this time around. And this one had a dwarf scroll. Once again, keep getting a lot of those. Even though I don't need them. Mahogany seed, another one. <laughs> Probably once again mistake the apple tree for <laughs> the tree. Oh, I can't believe I did that. I can't fucking believe I did that. I can't believe I'm that stupid. I am that absolutely fucking dumb. I am the dumbest I have ever seen in my life. Uh, and I've seen plenty of dumb. Oh boy, I have seen plenty of dumb in my 30 years of existence. Most of it coming from me, but that has got to be the dumbest I have ever been. Uh, more dumb than the time I could have finished Robin's project the first time. But instead, <laughs> instead, I neglected to cut down the mahogany tree that was already fully grown. <laughs> and I should have noticed was fully grown. Because instead, I decided to be uh, the dumb. 
All right, so we'll put... Wow, I have a lot of these. Wowzers. Like, maple seeds have been completely eradicated. And usually those are the most prosperous. Or at least when you begin your whole thing. That's the truth. Huh, ancient seeds. Wait. I can't grow these? No. <laughs> Don't tell me I had an opportunity to get one that'll actually grow. And I fucked it up. Don't tell me that. Don't tell me that. No, I don't want you to tell me that. Specifically, do not tell me that. I don't care if you feel it's right to tell me that. Don't tell me that. I specifically don't want to know. I'm asking you to not tell me because I don't want to know. <laughs> Please tell me. Please don't tell me. Tell me, but don't. Allude to it. Allude to the fact I fucked up without actually telling me I fucked up. Please, just do that. In some other way, other than telling me I'm stupid. Because I am stupid. I just literally had a soliloquy. A little monologue. Telling me I'm stupid. By my own mouth. But don't tell me that yourself. Let me know my own stupidity. my own way because I am that stupid and I know I'm that stupid oh boy oh why the fuck did I bother alright Abby another year is almost over goes by so fast doesn't it you're right it do it do so fast So fast and yet not fast enough. <laughs> Especially if it's particularly bad. Not fast enough. Boop. Just noticed there was something out here. Damn, it was clay. Aiken. I knew I was going to have to make the joke. I knew I was going to have to. Okay. Um... Go for iron, which really starts showing up around 40. Now oh, there's that. There's that. Ow. That one hurt. I keep forgetting. I get so powerful stuff. Such powerful stuff this late in the game. That I'm just blasting through these levels of mines. Ow! That like spike caused me damage. How dare. Like spike caused me damage mainly because I <laughs> was trying to defend myself. What? I was trying to defend myself against the slime and I couldn't because the like spike made me miss. Well, hi. And I picked up a rice shoot. Why? Why did this happen? I'm mildly confused. Bastard, get back here. Thank you for dying. It's a righteous cause. You're dying. Why am I... Why is this a thing?
I guess that's part of the unlucky portion of today. Never mind. <laughs> Fuck that thought. Never mind. <laughs> Just got done saying, oh, I guess it's, that's the unlucky portion of the spirits being very displeased with me. No, <laughs> that is not the case. In fact, apparently, I am so lucky that I got this after <laughs> backed off of a fucking dust sprite of all things. Of all things, I got off of a dust sprite. Absolutely. Completely bonkers. My god. How do you beat that, though? How do you beat that? Dwarf scroll. Okay, well, that's... Yeah, I was about to say virtually worthless. I didn't even get any money out of it. Out of my golden trash can that gives me extra money anytime I put something in it. Provides me the gift. Because <laughs> that's a universally loved. So, I mean, that provides me the gift to give to, <laughs> to, give to Evelyn. Ah, oh, boy. Why did, I, why did I think that that was. Doesn't matter. I thought that was a slime. It doesn't matter. It literally doesn't matter. I was... You've already had, like, three different monologues about how I'm stupid. We don't need to have another one. <sighs> okay. It's fine. It's fine. It's all fine. I don't know why it's fine. Because I said it's fine. I said it's fine, so it will be fine. Alright. Ow! Ow! Cool. Yay for me. Alright, it's like 710. Eh, I could use a little copper. Wow! Critical fucking hit. Beautiful. Oh, I got some Omni Geodes too. Well, what do I get rid of? Uh, I don't need bat wings all that much, do I? No, I don't need sap all that much. I have like two stacks already. I do want quartz though. I do want more quartz. Balls. I guess I don't need slime that much. There we go. Cool. Alright. Work my way around. Get all the minerals and ore that's available. Including this one. Alright. And with that, I go home. Leave the mine. And then go to the bus stop. Well, good thing my inventory was full, because that was worthless. I can technically put this... <sighs> there we go. And then I can sell this this way. And then pick that back up. Ha <laughs> ha! Loophole. Alrighty. And 
was about to say, I'm pretty sure I can sell all those. Might as well keep the rice shoot. Might as well. Um, hmm, hmm, hmm. Oh, I needed the amethyst. Can I go back? No, I already... Damn it! Doug, damn it, damn it. Oh, no, the Dimsdale, damn it, damn it. It's fine. It's fine. Putting this in my box, too. Just so I don't have to worry about it. Put the stone away, and we're good. And... Oh, I forgot to put the copper away. I'm stupid. That's not the one I wanted. This is the one I wanted. Play uh... doesn't go here. It goes in here. Better. And then the bat wing. Where does the rice chute go in here? Yes, it does. It do. It do, though. Why am I allowed to talk sometimes? I don't understand my own brain. Okay, and then we put the winter root in here. Food full. And we're good. All right. All right, and now we go to bed. And that makes it proper episode. Why are you sleeping over there? You silly cat. All righty, I got... Uh, okay. I forgot I had thrown the crystal fruit jelly in there. 490. Wow. Okay, that's a lot of money off of the jelly. All right. And with all of that, didn't do a bad haul. Did not have a bad haul at all. So, with all of that, I'm going to end the episode here for right now. Before I screw something else up. So, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share in comments so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one and only Stray Cat. Playing games and trying to keep my farm afloat. While also trying not to blow everything up. Because that seems to be the habit I've developed lately. Screwing everything up that I possibly can. But... We did quite a few, well, I mean, we did the Abigail mission. I guess we didn't do all that many. But we did get quite a bit further in Robin's project, and this time we won't screw it up like we did last time. Here's hoping. And, yeah, that's about it. Did some mining, did some good stuff, and here's hoping we're on the path to success. Considering all the mistakes I made thus far, it might be a little bit longer road to hoe than I think, but we should be fine. Probably. For me, and for you. We were, well, just trying to keep the farm organized as well as possible. With, you know, my inability to actually do that. Wow, this is a lag spike. Wow. Wow. I can't control anything. <laughs> there we go. What the hell? That was entirely the biggest lag spike I've ever experienced. Holy shit. All right. Yeah. <laughs>